hey what's up everybody today in this video i'm gonna show uh, my another new project which is spam email classifier so i have implemented that uh, using machine learning and this is my uh, second uh, another end-to-end -end machine learning project so we can see this is the data set and i i got this data set from kaggle so actually this is a very uh, interesting data set and this is very famous data set you can say there are lots of email and another is label okay so if I uh, if I show the data set in front of you so just see uh, this is the data set so you can see there are lots of email okay and uh, you can see there is the level of this email right uh, so you can so you can see uh, the one indicates the spam email and uh, zero indicates the uh, ham email okay so by using this data set i'm going to uh, implement a model which will uh, predict uh, uh, whether a email would be spam or ham okay so if you want to learn uh, nlp so i think this data set would be would be first recommend for you okay so now i'm going to show my uh, model uh, so I have opened my Jupyter notebook and here you can see I have imported some necessary library uh, for analyzing the data and uh, first of all I have loaded the data uh, from CSV file and you can see this is my data set and uh, there are two feature one is text and one is uh, spam which is our label okay so um, so based on this text we have to uh, predict uh, whether this email uh, spam or ham okay so if i show my uh, data set shape so here you can see uh, there are 5720 uh, email including uh, spam or ham and uh, there are two features okay so so if i show the first instant uh, from my data set so here you can see this is a uh, email okay and I think uh, this is a spam email okay if you read this carefully so I think you will understand uh, it would be a spam email okay let it go so then uh, I have just checked uh, whether uh, there is a more uh, spam email or uh, ham email okay so so you can see there are ham email more than spam email okay so I have separated the data set into uh, two set uh, one, uh, one is uh, the independent uh, independent variable and another is dependent variable which is which would be our level right and then I have split my data set into train and test okay and here I have kept just 20% uh, of data for testing purpose okay and another 80% of the data I'm going to use uh, um, to build a model okay so so here i have uh, imported the counter vectorizer which is really a uh, very interesting uh, pre-processing uh, package uh, and it, it comes from scikit-learn okay and uh, so counter vectorizer uh, by using this counter vectorizer we are going to pre-process the data because my algorithm can understand the text format okay so if i want to uh, make a model by using this uh, email algorithm so i have to pre-process the data and i have to clean the data okay so um, like uh, here now you can see this is a text data set okay so um, i have to make it as a uh, numerical data okay so for that i have uh, applied just uh, this counter vectorizer uh, on my data set then uh, my data set has become uh, you can say a uh, numerical uh, numerical variable now i can use this numerical value uh, to predict uh, um, to to build my uh, ml algorithm okay um, so here you can see I have used uh, the naive bias classifier uh, for this uh, problem scenario okay and I have used uh, this as so then I have used this uh, multinomial uh, naive bias okay so then I have made a pipeline for that then uh, uh, then I have uh, trained my data set uh, by using X train and Y train then um, if i show my accuracy score it was uh, around 99 percent okay so 
I can say this is really a uh, very good model okay for predicting uh, whether uh, whether an email would be uh, spam or ham okay I think uh, this is very uh, effective model you can say okay and uh, uh, if I show my uh, and, uh, anyway guys this is um, this is my testing is score okay uh, so you, you cannot say my model has been overfitted okay because this is my testing uh, th because this, this is my testing score okay so uh, this is uh, pretty much good actually this data set is uh, pretty much good for uh, uh, building a model okay and uh, then uh, I have just uh, ev evaluate the model uh, using an email and at the last of my uh, training uh, model I have uh, I have dumped this uh, I have dumped this uh, model uh, using pickle okay and because of that we can use this model for implementing uh, my web application okay so if I uh, show my uh, web application uh, actually this is my code and uh, I have used uh, Fla I have used flask uh, this is a, a Python framework okay so I have implemented this uh, web application by using this flask okay and uh, here you can see I have used a little bit HTML here uh, for designing my web application okay so if I open my uh, if I open my uh, classifier so this is the uh, so this is the front end guys okay so you can see um, here uh, this is recurring an email so if I uh, write an email uh, to check uh, whether uh, it is a uh, uh, spam or ham so we can check it very easily okay okay so for demonstration I'm going to write an email here and I will check it uh, whether um, my model is predicting uh, right or wrong okay so if I write a if I so if I write an email here so suppose I'm writing a spam email so so let me write so I'm going to write hey uh, I am Elon Musk you got a brand new car from Tesla okay to you get your car please uh, take the survey okay so uh, you can see guys uh, this is a spam email okay if you know uh, what kinds of email would be spam so this is a spam email so I'm going to check my model uh, whether it is predicting uh, right or wrong okay so if I submit this uh, uh, if I submit this email so here you can see yeah this is a spam email okay and my uh, model is predicting uh, right okay so here my model is predicting gotcha this is a spam message okay and uh, here uh, I have just uh, put a uh, funny photo uh, so yeah my model is predicting good and uh, let me so let me write an another uh, email and it would be uh, a ham email okay so if I write uh, hey uh, puppy what's up what's up dude oops what's up dude meet me at my home okay so if you see the email carefully so you will understand this is uh, not a so you will understand this is not a spam email okay it would be a ham email okay so okay I'm going to check my model whether it is predicting right or wrong so if I submit this email so here you can see yeah this is not a spam message okay so yeah so that's how my model is predicting whether an email uh, uh, is a, a spam or ham okay so uh, so this is a very interesting project of me because uh, I just heard of uh, email spam classifier and almost everybody use uh, Gmail uh, so, so so they know about spam they know about spam classifier of Gmail okay so I just heard of that but uh, today I have implemented that okay so this is really a great achievement for me okay because uh, I'm a new learner of uh, uh, machine learning and uh, and uh, still I am learning a lot okay and I'm trying to um, and I'm trying to go uh, toward the advance of machine learning okay and data science uh, so um, 
so this is really interesting to me okay so so I will try to bring up a more uh, uh, interesting project okay so thank you so much guys for watching this video and I will see you next time